Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Mel Holistic. I'm Mel. So today is a special because I'm going to do yoga on the bed. As you can see, I'm on my bed right now. And I'm going to do a sequence that will help you to relax, be stressed, and feel calm so that you can go into a better sleep for the night. So whenever you're ready, get yourself into some comfortable clothes, get on your bed, and let's begin. Now come to sit in a comfortable seated position. Back up right shoulders away from your ears, crown of the head high up towards the ceiling, and gently close your eyes with your hands on your knees. Now we'll start with some inhalation and exhalation exercise to calm your mind and your body down. As you inhale, fill your abdomen with air, let it bulge out naturally. As you exhale slowly through both of your nostrils, pull your belly button in towards the back. Let your abdomen go flat. Inhale through both nostrils. Exhale slowly, pull your belly button in again. One more time, inhale, exhale, good, and now gently open up your eyes, good, now raise your right hand up and bend over towards your left side, open up your right oblique, look up towards the ceiling, lengthen your right arm, and switch sides. Lengthen up your left hand, bend over to your right, this time left, and come in. Now twist over to your right side, left hand outside of your right knee, and look over your right shoulder. Good, and we switch sides, turning over towards your left. Head over towards your right shoulder, pointing your chin up 45 degrees. Good, and we switch sides. Drop your head over to your left shoulder, chin 45 degrees up, and then using your left hand to pull your head closer towards your left shoulder. Inhale and exhale. Good. Now coming into butterfly. So separate your knees, feet this together. Now flap your knees, flap your legs just a little bit to open up your hips. Good. And release. Good. Now straighten out your right leg towards the side. Now bending over to your right side, open up your left hand. Don't strain, it's just a gentle practice. Now slowly raise your left hand up, placing your left hand outside of your left knee. And slowly lift your pelvis up and raise your right hand up, pushing your pelvis forward, lengthening both of your arms. Good, and return. And now we switch legs. Bending your right knee, straighten out your left knee to the side. And bend over to what's your left side. Good, and release from the pose. Right hand outside of your right leg. And lift your pelvis up, straighten out your left hand and your right hand as well, pushing your pelvis forward. Good, and release. Okay, very good. Now, can you straighten both of your legs and just try to reach out towards your toes, sink into book pose. And 
good. And now let's lie onto our back, relaxing on the bed, bending both knees. Good. Now coming to happy baby pose. So now hands grabbing onto your feet from the inside and push your thighs down. Rocking the pelvis from side to side, from side to side. Happy baby. Walking happy baby. And okay, now release. Alright, now can you now hold on to your lower back coming into supported bridge pose? You can place your palm towards the inside. Coming into supported bridge pose, knees are hip width distance apart. Squeezing your glutes. Breathing in and out. In and out. Good. Now lower the pelvis down. Now raise both of your legs high up towards the ceiling into a 90 degree bend. Good, and just stay there, 90 degrees. Good, now straighten your hands up. Just stay there for a moment. Just letting your blood flow down. Good. And lower your legs down. Good, just relax for a moment here. Stretching your hands up and your legs. Rotate your ankles. Rotate your ankles a bit. And relax. Release your hands. Let's come into a plow pose. So bend both of your knees. Now straighten up your legs one more time. Your hands supporting your lower glutes. And gently push up. Pelvis up, knees are close towards the head, and just stay in plow pose. Here, and slowly lower your pelvis down, knees are close towards your face, legs back to 90 degrees, and now slowly lower your legs down. Yeah. Now coming up into pigeon pose good so now walk your right foot forward and drop your right knee down and just rest for a moment here in pigeon pose you can bend your elbows down and rest your face on the bed if you want to Taking a moment here. Head up and coming back. And we switch legs. Left foot forward. Left glutes down. Or if you can't place your left glutes down or your right glutes earlier on, you can place a towel below your glutes for support. And now walk your elbows forward, resting your forehead on the mat. And coming up. Good. Now release from the pose. Come to sit. Okay, how we started. And your breath in and out once more. Deep inhalation. Slow exhalation. One more time, inhale. Now let's lie on your abdomen. Supporting your upper body with your elbows, just stay in spins pose, squeezing your lower back and glutes together. 
Now straighten your elbows. <laughs> Squeezing your glutes together once more. Good. And lower down. Alright, now come to lie on your side with your elbows supporting your body. Now bending the right knee and lift it up, straightening your knee. Now if you want to, you can also lie onto, lie your arms down and use your hands to support your head and straighten out your leg. You might find that you might, you know, for beginners, you might roll down. If that is you, you can simply place your hand down for more support. Right? So find your balancing point. Good. And we switch side. Lie onto your side. Elbows on the bed. Hands supporting your head. Bending your knee and straighten out your knee for side stretch all right so don't over strain listen to your body and now release from the pose and come to lie on your back coming into fish pose so lift your upper chest up and place the crown of the head on the bed leaving an arch in your upper chest and open up your chest Resting in fish pose. Breathing in and out. In and out. In and out. Releasing from fish pose. Let's come to rest in Shavasana. Letting your whole body sink heavily into the mat. Let your focus be on your inhalation and exhalation. As you inhale, fill your abdomen with air. As you exhale slowly, pull your belly button in towards your back. Feeling relaxed. For those of you, if you want to, you could probably slowly drift into a good night's sleep. Feeling relaxed. Let your whole body and mind calm down. Now if you want to awaken, just wiggle your toes and your fingertips. Straighten up your arms and legs, stretching them in the opposite direction. And turning over to your right side. Rest for a moment here. Pressing your left hand into the mat. So you press your left hand into the bed. And come to sit. And one more time. Inhale. Hands up. Exhale. Hands down. More time, inhale, hands up, exhale, hands down. One last time, inhale, exhale. Now, palms together in front of your heart center. Gently bow to yourself. Namaste. And thank you for joining me in today's session, Yoga on a Bed. And if you liked and enjoyed what I shared with you, give me a thumbs up like, write in the comments what you enjoy, what are the other videos you would like me to do for you, and remember to subscribe for more videos to come. Take care and see you in my next video.